Hello, welcome to IMM. We've just put the final touches to a scene for the Gospel of John in our series Open the New Testament. And this seems as good a place as any to talk about costumes for Bible stories. Hollywood movies, church dramas, children's picture books are just three areas of our cultural life where we're used to seeing people dressed as characters from Bible times. Now, three questions may come to mind. The first is, is what I'm seeing really accurate? The second is, how can I get the right look for my production? And the third is, how can I do all that on a very low budget? Well, let me explain. This interpretation of the parable of the kings at war in Luke 14 shows metal armor and weapons, historically accurate and expensive. And the set is a reproduction of a Greek house of the second century BC. But in this scene, the soldiers in the army of King Herod in the first century BC are in plastic armor and weapons, and it's been shot out of doors, so there's nothing very costly here. The first question is what are we trying to achieve? Presenting a Christmas play in a church is not the same thing as illustrating an article for an academic journal on clothing in the Roman Empire. But even a Christmas play should, if possible, have the right look historically. But it also has to meet expectations in the audience that are based on a long tradition of Christian art, from stained glass windows, classical paintings and even Christmas cards. In this program, I'm going to show you some of the options, comment on them from a historical point of view, and show you how to make some of them on a fairly low budget and still get a look that's acceptable to most audiences. We've divided all this into chapters. And the first of them is on Jewish men, so we'll see you in a few moments. <laughs> 